Hi everyone, Miss Melinda here, your spiritual worker from Miss Melinda's Metaphysical Services.com. I'm going to take a moment today to talk a little bit about spiritual work and also inner transformation, uh, meditation, and mental work. So the first thing that I want to say is that um, any kind of transformation that you're seeking through magic or through spiritual work um, needs to start from within you, especially um, if it's a big issue in your life or if it's complicated um, or if it's a stubborn situation. Um, for example, let's say that you have been working for uh, to gain more passion and more love in your marriage and you've been contemplating this and you've been working on this for a few months and you you can't seem to quite put your finger on um, why it won't change. Well, if you are simply um, lighting a candle and asking spirit or asking your guides or a deity to change the situation for you, then that's why it's not changing. Because what you need to do is sit down and really think about what the root of the problem is. Think about um, why there is a lack of passion. Does it have something to do with your own actions? Does it have something to do with your partner's actions? Does it have something to do with your patterns of behavior, with your patterns of schedule? Does it have something to do with a deeper seated root problem in your relationship? These are the kinds of things that you need to think about. And then after you think about that, you need to make a plan of action. And then the next time that you go to your altar or you go to light your candle or say your prayers or do your meditations, then you would sit down and you would say something of the nature, something of the sorts, um, please help me to gain the kind of skills and characteristics that I need to tackle this problem. Please offer me guidance, assistance, and blessings in making the changes that I need to my daily schedule, making the changes that I need to make to my habits, to my mindsets, so that I can address this problem, so that I can bring more passion and bring more love into my relationship, right? So spiritual work is about getting um, spiritual support. It's about getting spiritual guidance and blessings. It is not about some force um, whipping into your life all of a sudden and changing everything for you and voila, everything is just exactly how you want it. You have to be willing to put the work in. Um, spiritual work supports the action that you do on the physical plane. So, um, you know, this, this is by no means exhaustive, but it is a good example of um, one aspect that needs to be addressed within your own work and within spiritual work. Uh, you know, spirit helps those who help themselves. I'm sure you've all heard that before. So meditation is another important aspect of spiritual work that I would like to touch base on. I get a lot of people asking me questions about things such as how do I get into a trance-like meditative state? Um, how do I tune into my own spiritual guidance? How do I um, channel spirit? How do I feel spiritual connection within myself? Okay, those are all things that you're going to have to put some work into. Those are not things that I can just give you some step-by-step -step instructions on how to do. Those are things that you're going to have to experiment with and learn how they work for you. And one really important way to do that experimentation or to train your mind in order to, you know, learn how this works for you is meditation. Meditation and mental exercises. That is why I'm always talking about these things. Um, meditation is going to allow you that space, that inner space that you need to really tune into yourself um, and to start to understand how your own spiritual connection works. Um, you know, start to understand, is it more of a visual thing for you? Is it more of a feeling for you? Is it a, a connection that you feel in your body? Is it a connection that you feel in your heart? Is it a connection that you feel in your third eye? Is it a, a matter of seeing visions? Is it a matter of hearing guidance? Um, 
all of those different things are things you're going to want to explore for yourself and they are all things that meditation can help you with. Um, in addition to mental exercises that help you learn how to focus and direct energy through your body and out of your body. Um, in addition to mental exercises that help you learn to concentrate for extended periods of time, visualize for extended periods of time, and um, things of that nature. Focus. Focus, concentration, and visualization. So um, meditation and uh, mental exercises, energy work, things of that nature are absolutely essential if you would like to develop yourself into someone who has a strong spiritual connection, into somebody who is able to perform powerful magic, into somebody who is able to create transformation in your life through spiritual work. Um, the reason that I call it spiritual work, it, and instead of calling it making magic or just casting spells, is because a, it is about having a spiritual connection, and B, it, is, it does require work. It is about work. So um, very literal definition, and I hope that this is helpful for you. I hope that um, some of you are coming to realize that this kind of thing takes work on your own behalf and that it's incredibly rewarding re work and that it, you will see results, it will work for you if you stick to it and you keep plugging away um, at a little bit each day, each week, each month, set aside some time, make it a priority in your life. You will see changes, you will feel changes um, in your thinking and in your feeling and in your daily connectedness to spirit and in your daily connectedness to yourself. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to share the video. Share it with friends of yours that you think may enjoy it. Um, leave a comment if you would like. Please like the video. Also, let me know if you have questions about anything that I mention in any of my videos. I'm always happy to answer questions in future videos. And if you have suggestions for anything you would like to see in a video, I'm happy to take those suggestions into consideration. So thanks so much for watching and have a great day.